Hello, and today I'm going to start a series where I replay the Finance of Freddy series. Um, this will all be done on mobile because I don't have a PC, so it's me on mobile. That's the best I got. So it's screen recording, but the quality should be fine. Um, sometimes, for probably the later nights, I will do a live commentary. Live commentary. And, yeah. So, I'm gonna make the video 1.5 because it's the first two nights and it's practically, like, there nothing happens, okay? Okay, so speed's now one and three quarters to make the video a bit shorter. Um, yeah. It's gonna be on the speed for practically the whole thing because there's practically almost no encounters, like, the whole recording because of the lower nights. And actually, what I noticed is that I think they might have updated it, which I have seen. Like, it says version something something in the corner. Um, like, they seem to be a lot more active on the first night. Foxy, you could actually see him in his curtain on the first night. He, there's a chance that he can actually come out. I don't think you can make him, but I, I checked him every once in a while, but, like, not much at all. And he actually, like, came onto his first stage of being in the curtain. And if you don't know that, um, Foxy progressively has these different stages where once he's in the final one and you see him gone, he's coming to your door. On the first night, he appears. And the 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 like the phone call only actually mentions him on the um, second night and says, and that that's when it actually tells you to check on him. So I don't know if they updated it or something like that. But yeah, that's one thing I noticed. They're actually a lot more active, surprisingly. Usually there is almost nothing, but there's actually some stuff, which is I think is pretty cool. But it doesn't, it's not good for really new people. I guess there's not much new players actually buying Finance at Freddy's. That's the thing about it. So, it's fine just having it like this. I couldn't, I can care less. Also, I know that Finance at Freddy's is a really unpopular game. But I thought just this would be a cool and easy idea for me to do over the holidays. Because it doesn't require a lot of editing. It just requires me to talk to you guys for 10 minutes over me playing just one game of FNAF, because it's a lot more easier over the holidays, and I also have online school, so that takes up a bit more time, but not much, so it's, uh, I, I like doing these more simple mobile videos when I don't have my electronics actually available, because I got combat on Xbox, so I couldn't actually stream, I was going to make a video, we had a, um, like a five stack, we were getting, we were getting DDoS, and I was going to record it, but I can't because my Xbox account was combat, so it it sucked. I did go on an alt account, but for some reason it still wouldn't let me. So, and right here, um, Bonnie moves, which is cool. It took him that long, but he he finally moved, so that's kind of cool, I guess. Um, I also do the second night of this video if you're wondering, and what I do for this night is once I know that I have enough power to just ride the rest of it. So I kind of just, um, I just close the doors and I just chill out, chill out for a little bit because there's not much for me to really do. So right here, I'm just going to cut out the rest of this because there actually nothing happens in the first night. There's no, there's not a single encounter at my door. Oh wait, no, there is. I think there is actually. So, uh, we'll, I'll see. I'm pretty sure there is though. Eh, I think I just closed my door on him though. But yeah, I'm going to cut out the rest of this, and then we'll actually go into the night two, where it's a bit more entertaining. So I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, so we're now on night two, where it's a bit more entertaining. I don't know the exact word you would say, but, you know, a, lot, a bit more stuff happens, so I can kind of talk about the game more, instead of just talking straight to you, because maybe that's uncomfortable. I, I, don't, I really don't know. I, I don't know. Um... We're actually getting close to 100 subscribers, and um, I'm I'm glad that we're, uh, once we get there, I'll do something. I'll do a giveaway at something, probably some Xbox money. I'll probably do like a $20 one to a random person who is subscribed, or my 100 subscriber. So, that, that might be cool. If you want to win that, then just subscribe, and it might not be 20, because... Maybe 10, but still, it is money. I'll give you guys something for reaching 100, because that that's that's a good goal. And once you're there, hoping that maybe I'll be put on people's recommended more instead of just, I don't know. 
making my family watch it. I don't, I don't do that, but I'm just saying. So yeah, um, in this game, Chica actually is a bit more active than Bonnie here. And um, this night, now I can't just like watch where they go because it gets a bit more hectic and everyone actually starts moving. Especially Foxy. For night two, he gets very active, actually. Like, I was checking him, but he he's aggressive. So Chica actually moved all the way from the dining area to the kitchen. Just skipped the restroom and the, uh... Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know. Um, Bonnie's also moved. So not much is still happening, but there is stuff happening. At this point, I can't really check them all because I don't want to get caught slacking, I guess. And want them to kill me because I don't want to redo this this night. I'm already this part in, and I don't want to redo it. I'm also running low on time here, so I might have to end the voiceover at a random time because I am going to my um, grandparents' house for Christmas. Since I have like two different families, I guess I have um, one Christmas on a day early so that I can go to the other house. Christmas I guess I don't know but and by the way one thing is that people will think that because you have two families you get double the Christmas presents if your family like if you're two different like parents if they're very spread apart then you'll get double or you'll get just like practically numb um because but thing is with my parents they they will practically like text each other like okay he wants this you'll get him this and you'll get him this so I won't get any duplicates kind of it's just they kind of split it in half, so I get half at one house, half at the other. Um, let's go back to the gameplay now. It, it's 3 a.m., and we get our first encounter. It's Bonnie, finally. After that long, we finally get someone showing up at our door. It actually took a very long time. Also, I was playing this game um, at the supper table, with my phone on my lap, because I, um... I didn't want to, like, redo the night, so I just decided to kind of, like, secretly play it at the start of the night. Not this now, because, as you can see, I'm a little more focused on this. I don't want to die, obviously. At this point, I noticed, okay, well, Foxy's not coming out much. I don't have to check him as much, and that was not smart, because he kind of just gives big karma here and just comes out of nowhere. He doesn't actually come to my door, but it's surprising what he does. So... Again, just checking lights a bunch because I don't. Really, I at this point I don't think I need to check Foxy much. It's only night two, and he just now mentioned him, and there he is. That's his face, for the first time we see his face. Well, I did see him on night one, and Bonnie comes back. And look at that! Just for not seeing him for a little bit, he is on the final stage of before running at me. On night two, he has gone that fast, moving. <laughs> I swear they must have like bumped it up or something, because I remember when I used like played it. And it was more of a newer game, I guess. They, it didn't move that fast. Like it wasn't that. It wasn't that intense. Thank God they didn't activate Freddy on these early nights. Or new players, literally, you have to search up a YouTube video or something. Because that's what I had to do when I was new. I didn't. I didn't know what to do. Well, I didn't actually search up for FNAF One because I watched Markiplier play it, and I, at the time, Freddy was like, not practically not a threat when I played. But now he is, so it's a bit different because he will be active a lot more, actually. It's because, judging from what Foxy's doing, I'm pretty sure Freddy will be more active. At this point, game's almost over. I'm just closing my door, and I'm just camping it out because and what else do I have to do? I have so much power left, I can just sit here. I know I could just play out the, game, the rest of the game normally, but... Practically no need for me to. <laughs> I had the hiccups, by the way. <laughs> That's why. Yeah, so I practically had no reason to actually play out the rest of the game. So I did this. Um, I appreciate you guys watching. And um, I'll see you guys at night three and four I'll do a video on. And then I'll do one for five. Bye-bye.